telling you, I can do no wrong. I mean, I could walk up to a woman and say, that sweater makes your rack look huge. And she'd just giggle and say, oh, you. Oh, you're on fire. And speaking of flaming, what's with the gay t-shirt? What are you talking about? Your t-shirt, it, it's gay. <laughs> look, it's a little boldly colored, but I wouldn't call it gay. The pink triangle is a symbol of the gay community. Says who? Says the gay community. It's how the Germans labeled homosexuals during World War II. That's insane. I've seen every episode of Hogan's Heroes and never once was that mentioned. <laughs> and besides, if it's a gay symbol, then why are models all over me when I wear it? Because they think you're gay. <laughs> you're talking nonsense, Carol. Well, on, models love gay guys. When you wear that T-shirt, you're neutral territory. You're like Switzerland. <laughs> really? And that's when I heard that Kim told Wendy that thing about my hair. What? Isn't she a little Tina Two-Face? <laughs> Thank you. Kelsey, can I tell you something? Something I've never told anyone? You mean like a secret? <laughs> yes. Okay, uh, here goes. <sighs> For the first time in my life, I find myself having sexual thoughts about... women. Really? Wow. Oh, my God. I can't believe I just said that. What is wrong with me? Vaughn! Bonnie! Sunny boy, hey! Hey, uh, who's the new girlfriend? Why do you always have to embarrass him every time he has a date? Oh, you are a hot ticket. Scooch over. <laughs> you know, they've got those sourdough pretzels over there like you like. Get out! Ooh, with a shot of zippy mustard. They're delicious, I tell you what. <laughs> Let me explain. I know what's going on. You haven't told your parents yet, have you? No. <laughs> I've lied to them. But what if I've also been lying to myself and I'm really, oh God, straight? Well, even if you are, you can still have a full and rewarding life. Well, yes, but how will I ever know? Oh, if only there were a way I could be with a woman just once and see how I feel. Well, I'm a woman. That sweater makes your rack look huge. Oh, you. Uh, oh, God, I'm, I'm so nervous. Just relax. Why don't you put on some music? Okay. Uh, what would you like to hear? Mm, do you have any Broadway musicals? <laughs> Why would I have Broadway musicals? A lot of gay guys are into that music. You didn't know that? Oh, Broadway musicals. <clears throat> uh, now, remember, uh, this is all so foreign to me, so please explain everything as we go along, okay? Do things twice if you need to. Okay. I'm going to kiss you now. <laughs> On the mouth? Yes. That was weird. <laughs> but I think I liked it. I swear, I've never had this problem before. Ask anyone. Vaughn, this is good. Now you know you're 100% gay. No, I'm not 100% gay. I'm, I'm more like 2% gay, tops. There's nothing to be ashamed of. You should be happy now you can put your doubts to rest. Wait, 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 don't go. Uh, just give me two minutes. My doubts are starting to awaken. You know what? I have a friend that I'd love to fix you up with. His name is Tommy. Tommy? Yeah, he's really cute. Well, someone's excited about meeting Tommy. No, 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 no. He's not excited about meeting Tommy. Tommy is definitely not my type. Oh, I know what you mean. Tommy's probably too butch for you. I'll call Cameron. Do you like rollerblading? 